plastics. So you're going to get, if you have a, <clears throat> you're doing a family and you've got kids, whether it's plastic cars, Legos, building blocks, any of that nature, plastic, as I said earlier, the pores open at 120 degrees. So I've got to clean at 125 so I can get that odor out. And um, I'm going to run 120 degrees or 125. This isn't, don't follow this slide. It's actually in the book. It's 125, 100% power. And I'm running two minutes to five minutes. Plastic takes longer. It doesn't attenuate sound, so it takes longer to clean. The process is the same, though. Unpack, pre-wash, wash, rinse, air dry, dry. But it just takes longer. So it's really important with plastics that you process those separately, that they're packed out separately, because it is going to take a lot longer to do something that's plastic. Uh, one of the things I didn't mention is things that are made of wood. So wooden, a wicker basket is obviously made of wood, <clears throat> but I'm not leaving it in the tank for more than a few seconds. So if I'm dealing with wood frames, uh, if, they're, if they're coated, you can generally clean those, maybe the same process, a very short time period. If it's a porous frame, you generally don't want to clean those in an ultrasonic tank. That would be, that'd be more of a hand clean. Photos, you want to hand clean. So most picture frames get, get all processed with a hand clean. So with plastics, again, the big, the big thing will be the, 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 the time cycle is longer and the temperature is elevated to 125.